Hi, this is Lou Serrano from LouSerranoMarketing.com. And you're probably wondering, what in the world was I doing playing the guitar? Well, before I was ever a student and teacher of marketing, before I was ever a magician, I was actually a musician. I played in Southern California in nightclubs in a heavy metal band for about 10 years. And um, I played all, all over the place, places like the Troubadour, the Whiskey A Go Go, the Roxy. Now, I just play for the fun of it. I haven't played in a nightclub playing music in about 20 years. I pick up the guitar about once every couple of months just to fiddle around, keep my fingers working. But um, it's a thing of the past. I love music, I love playing guitar, but my life is so busy I don't get a chance to really play very often. So what in the world does this have to do with marketing? Well, it has everything to do with marketing. Uh, today I wanted to talk to you about social media networking and Facebook in particular. You know, there's a school of thought that if you're going to use Facebook as a marketing tool, that you should only be posting things regarding your business. You shouldn't be posting anything uh, regarding your personal life. So you should be posting things like where you're performing if you're a magician, uh, things having to do with uh, testimonials, or if you're selling a product, things that are promoting your product. Well, I disagree. I think in this day, day and age, people want to do business with people they know, like, and trust. Actually. That's the way it's always been. People want to do business with people that they know, like, and trust. And if you're only posting things regarding your business, there's no way that people are, are ever going to get to know you. They're not going to know who you are. You know, people are sick and tired of dealing with huge companies that, where there's no really any personal interaction. They want to deal with people, human beings. So if you share things about your life, like me sharing things about playing guitar, uh, if you go to my Facebook, it's like I post things regarding going to concerts and to plays, and I post when I'm at the gym, and all types of different things. Sometimes I get too personal, but hey, you live and learn. You know, sometimes people think that my life is a soap opera, and that's okay, because uh, at least people get to know who I am. Now, you may not want to post a whole bunch of personal things about your life, and that's fine. But, I've gone both ways, where... I only posted things regarding my business and I got very little interaction on Facebook. Hardly anybody would comment on any of my posts. And then I went the other way. I would post all types of things regarding my personal life. And a lot of people started commenting. I got a lot of interaction with different people. People that later on became my friends. Friends through Facebook. Um, people that have became, become my customers. People that have bought my products. All because they got to know, like, and trust me. So use social media networking, Facebook in particular. I would talk about Twitter, but I'm not very good at Twitter. I'm still trying to get the hang of it. But uh, Facebook, I'm doing pretty good at it. So use it as a marketing tool, but use it so that people can get to know who you are. By the way, if you don't believe me, try it yourself. Only post things regarding your business and see how that works out for you. And then Try posting things regarding your personal life and mix that up. Try to get some sort of equilibrium where you're posting things regarding your business, posting things regarding your personal life. Now, here's something to keep in mind. Some people are just going to think that you're bragging. They're going to think that uh, you're showing off. And these people are not going to like you. These people are actually going to hate you. Who cares? They're, they're going to hate you anyway. They're just jealous people. Don't worry about those people. Those people have the, the option of unfriending you or blocking your posts if they want. Focus on the people that do want to get to know you, that do want to know what you're all about. Because those are the people that are actually going to turn into your friends and they're going to turn into your customers. By the way, if you're watching this on my blog, LouSeranoMarketing.com, make sure you leave your name and email address in the box that says leave your name and email address to receive more marketing tips. And that way you'll get all the marketing tips that I have to offer. So do that right now. Leave your name and email address. Till next time, this is Lou Serrano wishing you tremendous success.